Hello everybody and welcome to my first look, my first let's play of Buzzworld. So it looks like we've got two areas on the map. Southern China, all locked out, we can't get in there. And Chernobyl, which we can play through. Scenario 1. Okay, so it looks like we've got different scenarios to play through in different areas on the map. We've currently got two areas on the map. Chernobyl and South China. So, let's play. And I don't know if you noticed there on the map, but it did have a three mode option at the top. I've not yet played on that. This is literally my first go. I've had a little go setting up the controls. Now, regarding the controls, because somebody's going to ask me, can you use the steering wheel? I have seen steering wheel options to set up. Now you're going to have to have a little patience, a little bit of patience when you get into the game to set your steering wheel up and joypad. Um, I set this game up currently um, to use on my joypad controller, so I'm using an Xbox 360 controller as I play this game. Um, you can play it on the keyboard, the mouse, the controller and steering wheel. I have not tried the steering wheel, but the options looked as though they were there in the uh, control section. So, pick up passengers. Here we go. And regarding the hints that you're seeing at the bottom of the screen, I've also seen options to remove them as well. But as this is uh, my first go, I've, uh, I've decided to leave the uh, subtitles on. I've also seen options available to adjust uh, the suspension settings and things as well on the, uh, on the vehicle. So there's quite a few options available regarding setup and configuration uh, for your controllers and your, hard your hardware um, for this game. Various camera handles as well. That you can uh, that you can use. I've just got to get used to playing this, so you've just got to bear in mind that this is my first go. Now, them passengers don't seem to want to get on board. <laughs> I think they want to stay. Are they getting on? It doesn't look like they want to get on. I think uh, I think my bus is full. I think we're full. So they're going to have to wait for per perhaps wait for the next transportation. I'm afraid. So, don't move before the doors are closed. Doors are now closed. I'm just getting used to the buttons and the configuration, what I've set up. Um, various camera angles. Follow the convoy out of here. Indicators work, horns work. Um, yeah. First impressions. Well, I've only been playing it for a few minutes, but um, I'm, I am liking the game. This is my sort of game. I do like these kind of games. But it's early days yet. I expect more videos to come. So if you want to smack that like button and follow this series, I'm probably going to be playing as many of these scenarios and free modes in this game as I can. So I think for this, this video you're watching, if I can play through just one scenario on Chernobyl and hopefully I can unlock um, South China, and do a scenario in South China, then I will do another follow-on video. I expect there's going to be quite a few videos on this one. So, uh, yes, yeah, smack that like button, subscribe, say hello in the comment section below um, as I play through this uh, as I play through this game. Not too sure when this video will go on YouTube, but the game itself is released on the 29th of September 2022 for the PC on Steam. Um, what I'm playing through here is uh, pre-release um, gameplay before the game's actually been released. But it's available on Steam for the PC on the 29th of September 2022. Full, full description of the game, as always, will be in the video description below so graphics wise I am noticing all radiation there graphics wise I'm getting a few stutters um, when I was in the settings it was all set on ultra ultra settings I noticed so 
there is options there uh, for me to tone it down a little bit and perhaps I can get a bit, a little bit better optimization. I don't know. Oh, it's getting a bit eerie now. Getting a little bit of music coming on. So there was quite a lot of scenarios on this Chernobyl. This is scenario number one. I'm catching the side, them little posts there, and it's knocking a score down, so you get rated, there's like a score on it. I'm going to come out slightly just to the middle. I can't get as close to the right-hand side as what the uh, as what the convoy ahead is. I'm, uh, I'm a bad driver, I'm hitting the little posts. Oh, a lot of radiation here. We're just doing a mass evacuation of Chernobyl on scenario number one. So the game on Steam, it says it's about passenger transportations and various conditions. Starting from standard days of bus driver and ending with rescuing people who suffered from disasters. So it says enjoy amazing stories and various scenarios or experience the free mode. Yes, we saw that at the beginning. I thought there was a free mode. A free mode where you can create your own routes. So you can create your own routes and travel across the game maps the way you want. Now that's interesting. The time and place of the action are very diverse. Each map has its own atmosphere and scenarios. So... There's a free mode where you can create your own routes and travel across the game maps the way that you actually want. That is interesting. Regarding the actual scenarios, and we saw that there's quite a few scenarios on each map, it says that there are three types of scenarios. Standard scenarios, which are about driving people to their destinations. Scenarios of breakdowns. It's hard to keep up with the schedule when the engine is overeating and you constantly have to cool it down. Okay. And disasters. And off-road. Off-roading and rough roads. Okay, so there's quite a lot in the scenarios, but now we've gained a few points and we can... Possibly, I'm just wondering if if China, can we get into China and have a little go on China, the first, ah, oh, Sumami, free mode, no, we won't do the free mode, we'll play through scenario number one, Southern China, here we go. Having waited a while for it to load up. When it loads up, we will <laughs> we will start. Okay, press enter. Here we go. Oh, we got a little bit of an intro.
Now it also says in the description of this game, and I will put the full description uh, of the game in the uh, video description below. It says gain experience and unlock new scenarios, buzzes and upgrades. So the more you play, the more experience you gain, which allows you to level up. So we have got to evacuate um, people here before the uh, Samami hits, it looks like. Should be simple enough. We're in another vehicle as well. Look at this. Oh, the waves are getting closer. The water is rising. We better get a move on, Wobbles. Oh no, I'm putting the handbrake on before I've, even, before I've even stopped. I'm still not used to the configuration I've set up. Don't forget, this is, me, this is my first time playing. Right, I don't know what that guy's doing. He looks like he's praying there. Looks like some sort of fireman or rescue operative. But he does look like he's praying. Perhaps it's because I'm driving. Right, let's, uh, let's get on. I noticed there's traffic coming the other way. Shouldn't they be getting out of here? Oh no, wave! Oh, it tipped us up. Got hit by a mega wave there. I'm going to overshoot this one, possibly. Handbrake card, open the doors. Come on, get on, quick, quick, quick. The ocean's rising, the waves are coming in. Achievement unlocked. Look like there's a cowboy there getting on. The guy next to me looks like he's still praying. Right, away we go. Notice this traffic actually driving into the Samar. <laughs> They're going the wrong way. Oh no! Oh no! I saw that coming up in the mirrors actually. Did you notice it? No! No! We got taken out by a mega wave! Oh my gosh, and I thought I was doing pretty well, I was doing pretty quick. I thought I was going along really quickly. Okay, we'll have to redo that one. Route failed. Right, we'll have to redo that one and try to do it quicker. We'll have to try to be really quick here. Start the engine really quick, foot down and just go, go, go. Just go wait for it to load back up. So while it's loading back up, smack the like button, subscribe. <laughs> Wobbly Captain Gaming. Okay, can we skip this? We, we do not want to um, watch the uh, sort of intro again. Um, I have pressed enter, hold to skip. Let's try that again. See if we can skip that. Yes, we can. Okay. Okay, the secret to this is get out of here as fast as you can. Second attempt.
Overshot a little bit there, but did you hear the brake squeal? Come on, cowboy, get on, hurry up. I think that's them all. Shut the doors, handbrake off, and away we go. Okay, so far, so far so good this time. We've not been wiped out by a huge wave. slowed me off that has slowed me off oh no <laughs> we've been hit by a mega wave that it is really hard and i think i've just hit that uh, i think i've just had a collision with that other vehicle and that has knocked some points off me so to so if you notice you've got all those scenarios so you've got to be able to um get a certain amount of points I presume to unlock the next scenario but there is a free mode option as well of which I, I have not tried yet looking at the mini map it looks like we've got a bit of a winding road ahead
Okay, this may be the final destination. All the passengers should be safe up here. I don't know where they're going to go. Ah, you have earned the required amount of money. Go to map. So that's the first scenario completed in uh, South China, I think that was. So this is my first look at Buzzworld. Full description of the game will be in the video description below. If you could smack the like button, I'd be most grateful because uh, eight and a half thousand subscribers, we're still not getting comments or likes and uh, it really helps the channel if you can leave comments and likes, so I'd be most grateful. Um, look out for more follow on videos of this game. Um, I'm going to be playing a lot more of this. First impressions, I like it. This is my sort of game. Um, so, uh, yeah, look out for more um, videos of this uh, of this game. I will, while I'm here, if you want to hang around, I will go into just the options section where the controllers are, and I will just scroll up and down very quickly so you can just have a quick look. So, you've got PC, mouse, PC and mouse, controller, and there's a steering wheel option there but like I say you're gonna to have to have a little bit of patience setting up your steering wheel I haven't tried the steering wheel I don't know if it'll work on every steering wheel I have no idea but the option is there in game I set it up on the controller it took me about 10 minutes to configure my controller I've not got it perfect I do need to make a few adjustments but there's plenty of um, options in the uh, in the options menu so yeah I'm not going to go through all the options, but there's, there's a lot of options there. Keyboard, mouse, controller, steering wheel. Thanks for watching. Look out for future videos of this game. Don't forget to smack the like button and uh, take care.